Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Go Dynamic IT. If your Microsoft Office has expired or it's about to expire and you are planning to switch to a free Microsoft Office alternative, this video is for you. Today we are going to uninstall Office 365 completely from macOS. So let's get started. Okay, so as you can see on the screen, this is my macOS. So let me show you the version here. You can see this is about Mac and this is a Sonoma. And let's close this one and we have to go to application. So here is our application. So first thing first, we have to remove this applic office application from our application tab. So you can see this is the Excel. You can select the shift, Microsoft Defender, Outlook, PowerPoint, Word, and OneNote. Uh, do we have anything else here related to Microsoft? No, right? So these are the applications. So I press the shift and then selected the, all the Microsoft application and then right click on it. And then you have an option to move to trash. So click on the move to trash. You can see when you try to move to the trash, it will ask you to authenticate. So let's authenticate with our password here. Okay, so it's moving all the six item okay so as you can see here uh, almost all this microsoft has gone application has gone now it's time to delete this one drive this is what this was left so we have to uninstall this as well done okay so that is also uninstalled so let's verify once again okay done so the first task is done so we have removed this is from the application tab now we have to go to the containers so containers is something like if you are coming from the windows background you must know that when we delete the app we have to go and delete it from prefetch and the temp folder also containers are similar to this so we have to go to the go to and inside the go to we have to go to the folders go to folders inside the folders we have to type this one li library and then containers i will just put this uh, both this uh, link into the description you can go ahead and use that so first we have to go to the containers and go inside that and inside the container we have to remove this microsoft and then microsoft app so you see you we will see this uh, microsoft office microsoft excel kind of a stuff here so let's scroll it down and find it out where that hiding behind so you can see here we have a microsoft excel again press shift and then microsoft powerpoint microsoft word and do we have anything else so let's delete this all the thing delete this movie to trash then let's see if we have anything else related to microsoft okay and then we have to delete the com as well you can see this com.microsoft here just select this again for pressing the shift and you can select all of this and then right click and move it to trash let's find it out if we have anything left behind so that's it about the container now let's close this one so we have removed this files from the container then we have to go to click on the go and again click on the go on folders and this time we have to select the contain group container so remove this one and type this group container group containers and go inside that and inside that we have to select this you can see when you come come scroll it down and come to the bottom you see this ubf ubft select all this ubft and select this right click and move to trash okay so we have deleted all this stuff let's say do we have anything else left here no not left here so what we will do is what and you have to go to the go to and then you can select this and here you can type dot microsoft enter and it will show you if there is anything inside you can see when we search this microsoft it will showing in this mac and it will show you this all the file related to this packages which we have downloaded dot microsoft so we need to find it out if there is any folder related to dot microsoft here so if we can scroll it down and we have any okay so you can see this is our folder let's move it to trash that and then here also we have a folder right click on it move to trash yes Anything else we have related to this dot microsoft no right so we do not have any folder related to the microsoft okay so that's it for quick videos today so we have uninstalled the app from the application then we have deleted this microsoft directory from containers and then we have deleted the microsoft related file from the group containers also that's it for today's video if you found this video helpful please subscribe for more videos like it feel free to share your thoughts or suggestion in the comment below and let me know what topics you would like to see in the future video thanks for watching the video see you in the next one